I'm Ralph Mollis, and I'm the town manager of North Kingstown. Um, it's a community of about 28,000 residents. We have about a $150 million budget. So that town hall, it's a historic town hall. It sat vacant and stagnant for many, many years. Um, it was an old, very unenergy efficient building. We were able to pass a bond to restore and renovate this historic building. And in doing so, we were able to include a lot of energy efficient measures, which of course was very important to our project. Um, we went from oil to natural gas. Uh, we installed what they call low E or low energy windows. That building really is, a, is, a, is an example of what can be accomplished very low cost in order to provide a very energy efficient, uh, low footprint type of building. So in installing EV charges in town has been a priority of ours. And of course, as with many communities like ours, funding has been the real obstacle. Uh, but we're trying to be part of the infrastructure that is needed to of course encourage electric vehicles. So number one, putting these eight charging stations um, in North Kingstown Golf Course, we knew that 45,000 people would be traveling through that golf course each year. Number two, playing golf takes anywhere from two to four hours. So it's a perfect location for a charging station. Um, and now we're part of that I-95 corridor where we've, where we've eliminated that void. So we converted about 2,500 street lights in town. Um, we were able to convert them with LED fixtures, but also controls, meaning that we can dim them at any time. Um, that with the original savings was $180,000 with future savings of $120,000. So it's a significant savings to the town, provides public safety benefits, and also provides some energy efficient lighting uh, with over 2,500 streetlights in town. Again, it's, it's really been good to work with the Office of Energy Resources, and I would encourage other communities to do what we're doing, to reach out to the office, find out what is there. Um, right now, the office is helping us find some funding for our EV charging stations. And between partnering with the office in Rhode Island Energy, between the charging stations, the new municipal office building renovations, there's just a lot we can accomplish to um, lower our footprint and provide energy savings.